Hey guys, we're going to have a pretty quick one here today, but uh, I've been getting quite a few requests from guys that want to probe their tool length and diameter, but they don't want the actual diameter to show up in the offsets column. Instead, they want the, the value to actually come out as the difference between the diameter you thought the tool was and what it actually is. That way the number can be used for wear compensation. So in order to set up our probing for wear comp, it's a couple of different steps. It's not too bad. Our first step is going to be to go to the settings page. And the next thing we have to do is typically we'll be looking at all of our settings here. We're looking for setting number 23. One of the easiest ways that I can search for that is type in the number 23 and then I can press the F1 button to word search for that setting. The setting we're looking for is called 9000 Program Edit Lock. This allows us to unlock our access to all of our probing routines. So I'm gonna use the right arrow key, change that guy to off, and now setting 23 is off, meaning that we can now access the 9000 number programs. Step two, I'm gonna to go to the list program page. I'm gonna to go to my 9,000 number directory, press the right arrow key, and now you're gonna see that I have access to all of my probing macros. Program number that I'm looking for is gonna be program number 9852. Number 9852, I'm gonna press the select program button that way it makes it my active program for now. And I'm gonna press the edit button to go into edit mode. The program I'm looking for is this line number, pound sign two, right about here. I'm gonna arrow down to that number. I'm gonna go over to the pound sign variable that pound sign two is assigned to. I'm gonna change that guy to pound sign 19 if I want wear comp. It was originally set to a value of four as diameter comp. Once you change the variable, you're gonna to go to list program mode. You're gonna exit the 9000 number directory by using the left arrow key, exit back to your main list program mode. You're gonna select pretty much any other program that's outside of the 9000s. You'll head back to the settings page and you're gonna turn your program edit lock back on again. Right arrow key, select on, and enter to confirm it. That way your 9000s are now locked back out. Now when you go to the edit mode and you go into your VPS probing menus and you go into your tool offsets page and you do, for instance, let's say you automatically set the length and diameter for a certain tool you're now gonna give it a tool number, the tool type as you would before, fill in the information for the length, the diameter, and the edge measure height. The machine is still gonna do exactly the same probing routine, but now when you go to your offsets page, your offset diameter, instead of it being an actual diameter, it's gonna be the deviation or the difference between the diameter you thought it was gonna be and the diameter it actually is. Thank you for watching.